For the first time, a Florida man is speaking out. He was attacked by an alligator and lost his arm. Mm, tonight, he says he is lucky to be alive and incredibly grateful to strangers who rushed to his rescue. Jordan Rivera says he does not remember much about the attack on Sunday morning. What he does recall is being at a bar in Port Charlotte near Fort Myers. At one point, he had to use the bathroom but saw there was a big line. That's when the 24-year-old decided to go to the pond behind the bar. Next thing he knows, he's falling into the pond and waking up in a hospital without his right arm. Confusion, I was like, whoa, like I was just, cause I woke up and I was just sitting here and I looked over and then I saw my arm the way it was and I was like, ooh. It kinda just looks like my arm just there, but not there. Wow, he says if not for strangers at the bar, he likely would have died. They rushed to help him and pulled him out of the water and put a tourniquet on his arm. Uh, I was able to get him to shore, but not enough. So I left, came into the bar, told him to call 911. Uh, another uh, guy at the bar came out, was ex-military. He knew what was going on, so me and him dragged him out. We put a tourniquet on him and, uh, and just kind of try to keep him calm. The day of the attack, trappers spent hours trying to capture the 10 foot five gator from the water. The Florida Wildlife Commission confirmed that the gator was later killed, which is typical when it comes to alligator attacks. Well, he was very calm explaining what happened. Jeez, yeah. lost an arm. Yeah, so was the guy who had the, the kitten on his shoulder too. He kind of stole the ship. Yeah.